using all good YouTube, it is Mint! And welcome to Real World Fitness! Now you see the title on you, Sue's put it up, what's the title, Sue? You have not given me a title today, love. Well, come up with some shit in a bit. Can't think of anything just yet, but it'll be proper inspirational. That's right, as my good friend Brent at All Heart BMG would say, I'm back, baby. The positivity is back. But how do we go on with the weight this week? Let's see. So that's right, we lost nearly a pound and a half again. So this week, I took a page out of my good friend, Colin Delway's book, did a little bit of a diet break. Uh, last weekend, I had a day of eating more or less what I wanted, and then got back onto the super low carb, uh, highish fat, high protein diet. Cut out all unnecessarily, unnes unnecessary cardio, more or less I did two, two bits of cardio last week and with training uh, I've gone to a more of a higher rep range. Uh, usually I'm doing the four to six rep range with the heavy movements and the odd isolation movement that I do do, uh, they were normally about six to, rep, six to eight reps. So I've bumped them up about four or five reps each one. So the heavy basic compound movements, I'm hitting about 10 to 12 reps and the isolation movements, 15 reps plus while all the madness is going on in the world but we're not going to mention that are we Sue? It's all about positivity Well actually I was going to mention it but in a good way because I've been thinking about this and you'll never ever ever get the opportunity again to have this time off with your family Ever? Ever. Um, enjoy it if you can, if you're not poorly. I'm guessing. I would enjoy it because it, it's a break from the rat race. I'm, I'm guessing it's about probably a 12 to 16 week period we're going to be in this for. So I, you're never going to get you're never going to get this opportunity again to be with you, especially your kids. So I'm going to, going to mention three channels. Because you've got plenty of time on your hands, I would guess, at this present time, to go and visit. The first one is my good friend, Brent, at Hall, All Heart BMG. Get... He's a crazy motherfucker. Language! I know. He'll admit it himself. But go over there, give him some love, and you'll be hooked. I'll guarantee you. He's what I would call the best YouTuber out there that nobody knows about. And he will probably agree with me on that one. So I've just mentioned him before as well, Colin Dewey. Um, my exercise knowledge is pretty good. I've been training 30 plus years, but my nutrition has always been a bit, shall we say, hit and miss. Hit and, miss. and Colin's channel I've been watching for quite a while now. And he's got a good way of teaching you in a layman's terms. It's not too... Technically, it does go into it in depth, but it's a way that you can understand. And thirdly, I know everybody's doing these home workouts and whatnot. Everyone and his dog. And everybody and his dog <laughs> is doing it. But one thing I've always wanted to try, and I've never really had the time, is yoga. Really? You? Yoga yes, in? really. Yoga. Uh, and yes. at, the, at this present time, a bit of mind and body... Hot Self yoga, or just yoga? <laughs> well, turn the eating up and it's going to be hot yoga, isn't it? A bit of mind and body, well-being won't go amiss. No, unfortunately, you haven't got time on your hands because you're still working. I am still working, but uh, you've took away uh, some of the stuff that I normally do around the house because... So I've got that little bit more extra time. What, the washing up? Basically, That's yeah. That's all you did around the house. That could sometimes take me half an hour. So go and visit my good friend, the Jack Geek. Uh, all these channels, Sue will leave a description. A link. Sorry, a link in the description to their channels. And I know you're thinking, well, uh, I like weightlifting and all this. Well, Will is as strong as an ox as well, and he does yoga to supplement. To supplement his, his weight training. So go over and see all these channels, give them some, sword, some, some love. Give them some love. <laughs> and like I've said before, 
And Sue said, you will never ever get this opportunity again for self-improvement. It's up to you how you want to come out of this 12 to 16 week isolation period. Do you want to come out of it self-improved or do you want to come out of it 30 pounds heavier? I mean, personally, yeah, there's a fine line with that. Isn't there it? is a fine line, definitely. Because when you are at home, it's like, hmm, feeling a bit peckish, what's in the fridge? Yeah. Hmm, feeling a bit peckish, what's in the cupboard? Hmm. Yeah. I always wanted to make those chocolate brownies, I think I'll give them a whirl. Yeah, so be careful uh, what you have in the house in this period of time. Uh, I know everybody went out and bulk bought spaghetti and which was needless. Yeah. Um, pretty pointless. Uh, in the UK, we have now got, I think, a pretty good system in that only one person from your household goes and shops. And it's basically one in, one out, isn't it, in most shops at the moment. Yeah. And you sort of go around the store in a... I've not been, but you've been, so it's more of an uh, orderly fashion, isn't it? So, yeah. how were the uh, shelves stocked yesterday? Fine. They were fine. fine. So, all those people that bulk bought, uh, there was no point. Yeah. Uh, basically, all you did was put a strain on the uh, food chain. Anyway, moving on. So, me personally, how I want to come out of this is, now there is a show, uh, the, the same federation that uh, I was going to train at, uh, train at, uh, go for at Body Power, they're doing a show in October. Now, fingers crossed, this is going to still happen. Now, me, I'm going to experiment with diet and training methods because I'm going to be ahead of everybody who has not got access to a gym. So it could be a bit of a leveller, uh, this 16 week period, 12 to 16 week period for this competition. So it's October the 11th in York, I believe, Sue, that this was like an earmarked date. So all being well, I'm going to enter that. That is my, I'm announcing that now, I'm going to enter that. Because personally now, I don't think body power will be going ahead at... In what, in October, anyway? No, simply because... Yeah, the Birmingham NEC. NEC is going to be earmarked, or is our earmarked, a as a, a hospital. So I don't think that will be going ahead now. But we'll see. But we'll, we will see. So that's my goal in the next 12 to 16 weeks. Keep on track. If you can. If I can. As long as I stay fit and healthy, well, that is it. my goal. That's the, if you do stay well. That is it, yeah. That, that's the, that's the that's the crux of it, staying it fit and well in the next 12 to 16 weeks. So on that note, don't forget to check out these channels, but more importantly, like, subscribe, share, and what else babe? Look after yourself. Look after yourself, and we'll catch you next time.